In this video, we're going to use the remainder theorem to find the value of a missing constant. All right. Hi, everybody. So we're going to take a quick look at an example of the remainder theorem here. So the question is, when 2x cubed plus 3x squared plus kx plus 4 is divided by x minus 2, the remainder is, and in this case here, we're giving you a, an expression, okay? Um, what is the value of k here? Well, we're going to approach this the same way we would uh, any other question that's about the remainder theorem like this. I know that when I'm dividing by x minus 2, that means if I take my polynomial and plug in that positive 2, I'm going to change the sign. Okay, I'm, I'm picking the number that makes that, that uh, divisor there equal to 0. If I plug that in, that is going to equal the remainder, which in this case is going to be 2 times 4 minus k. Now, plugging 2 into the, uh, into the polynomial, remember this is my polynomial, so that's going to be 2 times 2 cubed plus 3 times 2 squared plus k times 2 plus 4. That's, that's my p of 2. And now I'm going to distribute that 2 through on the right-hand side to get 8 minus 2k. Now evaluate. 2 cubed is, is 8 times 2 is going to be 16. Uh, 2 squared is 4 times 3 is going to be 12. And then I've got this plus 2k. And then the plus 4 equals 8 minus 2k. Okay. Now I'm just going to simplify things here. So 16 plus 12, okay, is going to be 28 plus 4 is going to be 32 plus 2k equals 8 minus 2k. Uh, now I'm going to bring the 2k over. So I'm going to get 4k over here. And then I'm going to subtract 32 from both sides. And 8 minus 32 is going to be negative uh, 24. Okay. Now I'm going to divide both sides by 4 to get my k, and I'm going to get that k is equal to negative 6. And so that's, that's how this question uh, would be approached.